Done and done. Music to my ears. Hey, just tucked off another thing off my to-do list, which is getting insanely long with the surgical registrars arriving soon. Yeah, can you just get HR to help you? Look, I, I, I've asked them. They, they say get the CEO to clear it or ask the CEO to increase the budget. Well, I'll sort it tomorrow. That's what you said yesterday. I mean, like, Dom Hagley's dying. Could you just have a heart? Right, I'm going to be in HDU if you need me. Please divert my calls. I am not here. Night, David. Oh, good night. One more thing, Monique. Can you please go through the applications for the new radiologist? Ah, uh, shouldn't that be something you do yourself? I'm delegating. I trust your judgment. Right, that's brilliant. Not coping with the workload? There is a difference between delegating and getting someone to do your entire job for you. Really? Sorry, just just me. You think there's a tad too much delegation going on? Look, don't get me wrong, I love Harper. I think she is amazing, but they keep needing her in ED where she is saving lives. But you keep picking up the slack. Some days I am practically acting CEO, not her. Kia ora, Shorten Street Hospital. Harper has left for the day, but I can sort that one for you. Can I get you anything? More time, sweetheart. Let's go grab something to eat. He's lost so much because of me. Just the way that he looks at you says otherwise. I just can't believe that we finally got together and I just spent so much time planning the wedding to the wrong guy. And now I've got the right guy and I can't even marry him. Who says you can't? Sorry for wasting all those years running from you, avoiding you. I think I was just scared of the way that you make me feel, the love that you make me feel. Who knows how much time we've got? But I want to make every day count. I want to be your wife, and I want you to be my husband for as long as we've got. What? ED doctor, right? Yes. Is she okay? She had overwhelming sepsis, went into multi-organ failure. We couldn't save her. What? That is awful. Has she got family or...? Her fiancé is flying in from Sydney, landing soon, I think. Could you give me the contact details? Sure. I'm sorry, Jack. We gave it our all. It's not your fault. Yeah, I know. It just sucks. Look, about Nina, we're not actually that close. I mean, sure, we've been for a couple of wines, we talked about going on a hunting trip, but honestly... Dawn, that's fine. Well, I just, I know how you feel about guns. Yeah, but uh, you know how I feel about you too. Well, maybe we can go on a hunting trip or... Doubt it. No. Uh, Nick, any progress on Corinne's family or her fiancé? Yeah, they're meeting Chris in about an hour. Okay, I'll be there. Hey, oh, shit! Oh. Sorry, I'm just in a hurry. Isn't everyone? Why is everyone in such a bad mood today? Well, we can't always be as upbeat as you, Dawn. We just need some good news stories. Actually... Whoop, here we go again. Well, obviously I'll take care of the ceremony. Now, what about music? Oh, could you organise that too? <laughs> well, you know me. Love a challenge. You are a legend, Leanne. I do my best. Uh, hair and makeup. Yeah, I think Amy's organising that. No, I'm talking about us. <laughs> <laughs> and we need to uh, get a final number so that we can move forward on the catering. So it's his birthday? Ah, if only. No, we're trying to put on a wedding in HDU today. Mm, a couple of patients, a motorcycle crash. Uh, Leanne, could you give us the room for a minute? But we haven't got to the order of service. I don't think you understand, David, what's involved here. We are on the clock. Uh, Leanne, I'll catch up with you when I'm done here. OK, right. <laughs> Leave everything to me. It's my koha to the tragic couple. Wedding. Seems rather time-consuming. Yeah, well, the staff have really bonded with the couple, so... 
A CEO has to oversee the big picture, not get caught up in all the small stuff. Right. Well, I support my staff and trust my gut instinct. Actually, a CEO's duty is to the board and the budget. I think maybe you and I should have a bit of a chat about how this position's working out for you. It's amazing. Okay, we'll come and pick them up soon. Okay, thanks. Bye. Right, Lola, uh, whipping up some platters. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> and did you say that Drew has a portable speaker? Yes, I'll nip home and get that too. You're leaving? Uh, yeah, just briefly. Right, well, I set up those radiologist interviews like you asked, so maybe you want to cast your eye over the candidates that I've interviewed this morning? Yes, um, it's not actually my responsibility anymore. It's, it's the CEO's job. Yeah, I'm no longer the CEO. Um, just had a conversation with David. What? Yeah, I'll just be here to VD and that is it. Mm. But hadn't you better get a wriggle on? Yeah, um, thank you for all your support, Monique. You've been, you've been wonderful. Mm.